All right, so we got Batman Arkham Shadow, new game details and Easter eggs videos by Batman Arkham Videos. Uh, shout out to him or her, whoever's behind an account, shout out to them for actually putting this together because I was completely confused upon like how they got these Easter eggs. So let's get into the video, let's go. How do they even like get like this? How do they even like get like this? All right, we, we, we're gonna pause it and read it. Uh, Batman Arkham Shadow is a thrilling new addition to the Arkham franchise. Wait, so this is like officially a part of it? Now, listen, this is very rare of me pausing the video and stuff like that. So best believe uh, you will get this only once, okay? You get you get what I'm saying? Okay, let's go. All right, so a thrilling new addition to the Arkham franchise is set to launch exclusively on the Oculus Meta Quest 3 later this year. I'm gonna try to read it while I was going, you know? Then we can go back and skim and read. Uh, developed by Camouflage, a uh, uh, renowned uh, by the work of Marvel Iron Man VR for Quest 2, Batman Arkham marks their most ambition. Okay, the teaser trailer provides some glimpses and Easter eggs, offering a taste of what's to come. Uh, uh, yeah, we've seen this rap. Oh, I didn't even see that. It's Harley Quinn's uh, badge. I didn't even see that. Vote Den Pen. Okay, uh, uh, Harvey Dent, Two Face. Okay, I didn't even see that. Vote Den again. Okay. Obviously, Harvey Dent is trying to become mayor. Bank of Gotham billboard. Okay, Falcone warehouse billboard. Oh, okay. Was it Don Falcone, right? Obviously, Don Falcone's like the he's like a big head honcho in Gotham. The presence of a gas mask was it? The rat catcher. Wait, that's a focus on passing the main villain. That's a villain. Wait, the wait the rat catcher. That that's a Batman villain. Uh oh. Uh, rat catcher, including the. Wait, I've never seen the rat catcher ever before in my life. Uh oh. The front of the rat catchers. VR will certainly be a unique experience. I mean, yeah, I think it would. I I, I can pause it right here since like that's like kind of like near the end. Uh, from the details, it appears that the game uh, will take place in a timeline between. Arkham Origins and Arkham Asylum. Wait, that's like, hold up. It will take place in between Arkham Origins and Arkham Asylum. That's like, bro, that's like back. Like that, I'm like, I'm like, that's back, back. Like, because Origins was before City. Obviously, it was before. Uh, if you guys don't know, Night was like the last Batman Arkham, like, you know, game that was labeled as Batman Arkham. Yeah, bro, Origins and Asylum, like, those were, like, 2011, 2009-ish, right? What's I, Wait, Asylum came... What, what year did Asylum come out? Uh, Roger Craig Smith... I, I, I'm sorry if I said this. Roger Craig Smith, uh, who voiced Batman uh, and, um, and Arkham Origins may return for him. People having this been close. Oh, snap. Bro, y'all are like detectives out here, bro. Tune in for the uh, premiere at the Summer Games Fest. Oh my God. Oh, I forgot the Summer's Games Fest. The full uh, official trailer will be debut at Summer's Games Fest. How come I didn't know about this? When we're... Oh no. Oh no. Okay. Oh my God, shout out to Batman Arkham Videos for this information. Okay, oh my God, listen, June is going to be very hectic, but it's gonna be a good hectic because I did not, listen, I'm just now knowing this right now. So, if you guys remember how, uh, I think uh, earlier, was it earlier this month? I think it was, I think it was either later last month, it was late last month or earlier this month where um, obviously Batman Arkham Shadow first, you know, trailer first happened, right? So I'm immediately thinking, right? Listen, let me tell you my whole, like, process whenever the, uh, whenever the trailer drop. The trailer drops, right? It's, like, 10 a.m. I'm, like, it's, it's bright and early. I think I was ready to, like, record, like, uh, like a Warzone highlights video. I think that's what, like, that's, like, one of the first, uh, videos that, like, you know, that I record because, you know, it's, it's, it's like a perfect like starter, you know, because I got like a lot of like other trailers and a lot of other like you know games or whatever just behind it. So a war zone like compilation is perfect to start. You know, it's, it's perfect to start up the day, right, bro? I load up YouTube, right, just to load up YouTube because I'm like, all right, let's just see what's you know what's what's on, right, bro? Boom! It says like four minutes ago, Batman Arkham Shadow. 
I'm like, hold up. I'm like, whoa, 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 whoa. Excuse me, miss. I see you from across the room. I'm like, wait a minute. I'm like, wait, 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 wait. Wait, what, what's Batman Arkham Shadow? I'm thinking that's like some type of DLC. In my head, I'm like, bro, I've never, never in my life ever played Batman Arkham Shadow. Brother, turns out that that's it's, it's a new game. So automatically, my heart's beating. I'm like, oh my God. Like, all right. So I load up everything. I get everything set, get the headphones. Like, I, I, everything's booted up, right? And I, I'm immediately, I start it. Turns out, I mean, I wasn't disappointed, but I'm thinking, oh, this might be like a new Batman game. Like, we got like a Batman game, you know, like, we got two Batman games in a row. Like, that, like, like, you know, that's never really happened before. Like, we got two Batman games in one year. Um, turns out it's on an Oculus. It's on an Oculus. I mean, we're still going to have two Batman games in the same year, but it's going to be on, like, the Oculus and, like, the Meta Quest and stuff like that. So, um, I was just super excited. Um, one thing is, I've never really played too many games on an Oculus. I just wanted to get, like, you know, just get that out the way. Um, not really. I mean, I'm not, I don't hate the thing. It's just, like, I never just, I never really got on it. All right, so listen, I didn't even know that the full trailer, I, I didn't even know that the full trailer will, will, will be, bro, I forgot that the Summer's Game Fest, I forgot that that was like, my bro, the whole time I'm thinking, okay, the Summer Game Fest is going to be happening in July. No, it's happening on the 7th, and I can't believe I let that slip out of my mind. Brother, we got the Summer's Game Fest on the 7th, then we got the uh, Xbox Showcase on the 9th, then we have the Call of Duty reveal right after the Xbox showcase. So guess what, brother? I'm not going to be sleeping for like a week. I'm going to be honest with you. What's this, like, listen, what's this is probably terrible for my health, but I'm going to be honest with you. Listen, if, if, if it's for me getting the content out to you guys and me getting my reaction to every one of these amazing games, it's worth it. I, it does not matter, brother. Um, I literally forgot that the Summer's Game Fest was going to be on the uh, 7th. I, I don't know why, but I just immediately thought it was going to be uh, in July. So... Right there, I'm caught off guard. So now that I know, though, that's the thing. I know now. It's in my brain. Boom. I'll remember it. Now, let's get to uh, the Easter eggs and the details. I'm going to be honest with you. I do not know about the Rat Catcher. I didn't even know that was like a villain. I'm, I'm going to be honest with you. Because I actually, I remember in like my first reaction, I was confused because I'm like, bro, I see like a lot of rats. Now, I was like, all right, maybe that's just like Gotham, like, you know, alleyways, whatever, like, you know. It's Gotham's like it's just dirty. Like it like Gotham is just like a dirtier New York. <laughs> so like I'm thinking on Mac, I'm thinking, okay, well, this is Gotham. Like these rats are like a big thing of the trailer, but maybe they're like a part of like I don't know, like I, I don't know. I was thinking like the penguin or something. Like I was like, bro, what like what are these rats for? But I didn't really like you know think too much about it. Um so the rat catcher turns out that's gonna be um a thing now. I don't know who the rat catcher is. Um looking at his picture. It looks like a villain from like back in the day. I'm gonna be honest with you. If you guys don't know, if you guys don't know, Batman has so many villains, especially like the villains that like, oh my god, like I'm talking villains that was in like the uh, like the 1960s shows. I'm talking villains that was like in the comic books that that aren't really um, seen in like the main media and stuff like that. Like, bro, I really want. Um, now I don't know. There was a villain called False Face. Bro, I really want False Face to be in like a Batman game, bro. Honestly, False Face, I want False Face to be in there. I want uh, Professor Pig to be in more games and stuff because, in my opinion, I think Professor Pig has to be like, I think Professor Pig has to be like one of the, like the worst villains in like the Batman franchise. When I mean worst, I don't mean worst as in like oh, like, like the villains is horrible. I mean the villain like like he is like worse as in like um. Just, just like he's a menace, basically. Like he's a school, like he's just a school bully. Like, bro, he'll pick you up, turn you upside down, bro, and shake you so all the coins can come out. Like he's one of those type of people. So, like, that's why I say like as worse. I mean, like it's a good thing for him, basically. Like as I'm saying, worse. So, I want uh, Professor Big to be in the game. I do not know who the Rat Catcher is, but I mean, I'm gonna be honest with you. Um, I imagine. Listen, if you look like this back then, I imagine they're gonna polish him up. I mean, he has, like, the red gloves. He's probably going to look really scary, like, in real life or whatever. So, uh, not in real life, sorry. And, like, VR. I mean, you know what? Yeah, in real life, okay? Listen, those VR graphics is, it, it, bro, too strong. So, um, we'll definitely check that out later this year. I don't know when it's going to come out later this year. But we'll probably, listen, we'll probably, you know, learn the uh, learn the release date on the 7th. I don't even know. I, I promise you, I did not know that the full trailer of this game was dropping on the 7th. At the Summer Game Fest. I'm really excited about that. Other than that, man, listen. I, I really don't... I, I don't have anything much to say. I'm like, I'm just being honest. We got Harley Quinn in the game. That's a good thing as well. 
Um, bro, listen, I know y'all freaks out there, bro. Harley Quinn and VR, bro, y'all gonna be acting different, bro. Let's <laughs> listen, listen. I'm listen. I'm a man, bro. I know how some of y'all act. I know how some of y'all think, bro. Harley Quinn and VR, bro. Y'all put the go insane, bro. Demons, bro. And guess what, bro? I, I just wish that like that the that the meta quest would just like record like everything y'all look. I, bro, I wish the meta quest had like some type of like eye tracker. So, like, <laughs> I'm playing, but listen, y'all be down bad, though, honestly. That's what I'm really serious about. Y'all be really down bad. Comment down below. What do you guys think about some of these Easter eggs? So now we do know that there's a vi there's a villain called the Rat Catcher. I did not know that villain, whatever. He's in the game. Harley Quinn's in the game. Um, Harvey Dent's in the game, obviously. Well, Harvey Dent's in, like, every Batman game. He's trying to be the mayor. He, he was, I mean, Harvey Dent is, like, a big, um, he is, like, a big, uh, Harvey Dent is, like, a big figure in Gotham, so, like, he kind of has to be. He doesn't have to, but he kind of has to be in the game. Um, and then, obviously, you know, Two-Face. I'm actually, cra listen, I'm actually, like, kind of scared to see, like, how the Joker. I'm the, Listen, it's a Batman game. The Joker has to be. The Joker has. There's no shot. The Joker has to be um, in this game, especially if it takes place between um, Origins and Asylum. Yeah, the Joker has to be in this game. Um, also... The thing is, I'm not expecting this game to be big. Um, Black Mask, like like the Brooklyn, like the like the uh, hard New York slang, you know, type of Black Mask. I'm expecting him to be in the game. Um, I do not want Bane in the game. Bane's going to be horrifying. Um, Scarecrow would be nice. He would look scary, like in the VR stuff. Comment down below. What do you guys think? What villains do you want in the game? Comment down below. Uh, what do you guys just think about this overall? I kind of listen. I, I got a bunch of new information in one video, so I'm kind of excited um, that I covered this because I would had not known. Which could have been a good thing because like my reaction would have been like really raw. Obviously, you know my reaction is gonna be really raw like whenever I see the trailer. But um, I was not expecting them to drop a full trailer for this game um, on June 7th. So we're gonna be there. Oh my God, brother, my schedule is gonna be packed. <laughs> My schedule is going to be packed. June 7th, Summer Game Fest. June 9th, Xbox uh, Studio. Yeah, I said Xbox Studios. Well, yeah, Xbox Studios uh, Showcase. And then Call of Duty Black Ops 6 to finish off that day. So, listen. June. Woo. And then, you, and then, and then, and then, guess what? You think I'm going to have a break? No, I'm not going to have a break. Because guess what? Elder Ring's right around the corner. <laughs> Elder Ring is right around the corner. So, if you guys, listen, if you guys love these games that i'm mentioning right now whatever listen subscribe to the channel like the video because best believe there's going to be a lot of videos in june i promise you that all right so see you guys on the face i'm out i'm out and